Hey y'all, it's Betsy from Happily Ever After, etc. And we're here to have a sneak peek today. First time ever seeing my house, so we are still on the lot. Like you can hear the highway, we are literally we can see it. Had to climb up on a brick to get in here because we don't have any steps. And there's new lots, so we can't even get inside. It's very secure. <laughs> but we're here. She said the back half of the house is unlocked, so I will show you around there. But this is the dining room. And this will be my house in, and isn't this in a week or two. Porch cool. <laughs> the porch is cool. So I'm gonna probably redo the actual porch part eventually. It's untreated right now. Um, and eventually I'll probably put a little what little table and chair here or something. And then I wanna put an actual table here to sit at and eat and more importantly to projects. <laughs> That's what most people do on their front porches. Yep. So my question is this, I have some really pretty blue lockers and I was thinking I was gonna put them here in front of this window, but they're short and they come out. I don't know that I'm gonna be able to. You may have to put them there. I may have to put them where the grill goes. Well, so we have priorities here. Yep. Some people like grills, I like lockers. They could go here and I could still put a little grill next to them. Yeah. I just might have to mm -hmm. build a little overhang or something. I mean, they're metal lockers. Mm -hmm. All right, guys, it's all buttoned up. Let, let's walk around and go see the back. Here it is. Show them. Did you show them in the window, Mom? Da, da, da. Isn't that awesome? So they moved. Oh, I love that. The little chandelier over here and the big fan over there for the living room. And look at the, um, look at the shiplap wall. Shiplap and the beam. It's going to be really awesome. Yep. All right, let's go to the other side. All right, y'all. So we just came in the laundry room door, da, which da, 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 da. is black. This is the original door. Like, if you get this house and you don't change it, this is what the doors look like. I changed the front ones to that white 15 panel because I like it better. But I left it black in the back because this is where my dogs are going to live when I'm at work. So this is where my champagne washer and dryer are going to go because I bought a champagne washer and dryer. I'm very excited. This is where the dogs are going to live and we're going to do a whole built-in so that'll be a project. Then we come through the butler's pantry and mm -hmm. you may watch me fall down a couple times because this house is definitely like on its health right now. Here is the kitchen da, da, da. and you can see I changed out the sink. So here's your first look at my pretty sink. I love the white. This is oil rub bronze. Thought it was gonna be more copper, but it matches the hardware and the faucets and the other bathrooms. So I do like that. This is the island. You guys follow me on Instagram. You know we have been debating what stools to put with this island. I'm still not sold. So if you want to get in on that debate, go to Instagram. There's her range hood. And my range bed, and I bought, I already bought the perfect blush magnolia wreath to hang here. Yay. It's going to be perfect. And don't you love the ceiling? And the ceiling, yes, they've seen the ceiling on the model. And the lights. And these lights are way more blue than the model, so. Which I like. Mom likes it, I'm not sure I like it. It's fine. And here's her bowling alley here's hallway. The bowling alley, so here's the sheeting. Don't go feel the sheeting. This is where my entertainment system will go, and you can see it doesn't have that stupid thing here. Yep. So I can put my little TV, TV cabinet. Yeah. And look at the cute lights. We Aren't may those make cute? those copper. What do y'all think? Yep. And my thermostat. And the guest room. This is where that desk originally was, and it is now a closet. Woohoo! The closet is on the other half of the house, so you'll have to wait on that. Yep. Here is the guest room where Rachel will stay. And I'm guessing those are my bathroom mirrors, which is always good. Yep. Here is the entrance to the blog office. It's on the other half of the house. And the guest bathroom. And this is a nice big bathroom. This is a nice big bathroom. And I really like, see this is all oil rub bronze. Yeah. And so it all matches there. Which and is all nice. the 
doorknobs. All the doorknobs and everything. And look at how much storage. There's a lot of storage even for a guest bath in here. Yeah, look at that. See, even this is oil red bronze. Look at that vanity. It's very nice. And the pretty doorknobs. And this is going into the master. This is the master. This is the other part of the master when we looked in the window and mom was like, it's so small. Here's the rest of it. Yep. Which is amazing how like four or five, four, four feet. and a half feet makes a lot of difference. And this. This is the crown jewel, the biggest bathroom. She will have for I'll a while. I have in my life. I wouldn't say that, but you never know. I hope so. Nobody needs to clean a bigger bathroom than this. Yeah, that is true. And look at these cool this is Mom's shades. Favorite part. Yeah, look at that. They look at just that. come right down and, and right up. Isn't that cool? They're, what she call them, stringless? Yeah, stringless. I had no idea they worked like that, but I mean, it looks easy. It, it was easy. There's this the touch. Much better bronze. Yeah. And then the faucet in there. I wish yeah. it was more like that. Eh, it's all but good. But either way, I like it. I can't wait till they bring it out and we can. There's our shower. And I'll show you guys that whole process. But and there's the potty with a little wall. That concludes the whole tour of it in two pieces on the lot. And I will show you guys later. Bye.